water polo is a fascinating sport because, as you point out, it's a tip of the iceberg sport. Mm. There's what you see on top of basically, uh, you know, men and women swimming around, having the ball on their nose, picking the ball up and throwing it into the goal, that sort of stuff. But below the surface, there's an absolutely volcanic here eruption. We yeah, we can see above, we above decks here, I now, see. But we should warn families now. to look away at this stage here because a lot of bloody wrestling goes on. Yeah. Look, a lot of tugging goes on. Yep. I think that's Hungary v Croatia. Yeah. Look at that, yeah. you know. Why the referee doesn't blow that up, yeah. I don't well, the know. The referee's unaware. That's right. That's here right. Here we go. Yeah, and you'll see a little more uh, action here underneath the surface. One bloke goes the tug there, yeah. and the other bloke gets him back. Here we it's, are. Uh, it's a very violent, aggressive, <laughs> wonderful sport. Yes, it is. Isn't it? <clears throat> It makes us though, look as though they found the missing bits of yeah, the, the pots. Yeah, the Greco-Roman, yes, that's right. Yes, that's right. That's right. I don't think we need to dig up <laughs> Italy to attempt the 200 feet anymore. No. All we've got to do is look at the rules of mm. water polo. Mm. Now, uh, what I worry about here is, mm. is this fair? I mean, on top, you've obviously... The, the referee isn't meant to be Superman and being able to see through objects like water, uh, you know, as, as clearly as he can. He's got reflections to worry about and so on. He's also got to look at all the players and obviously a lot of groping's going on down there while they've got the ball up the other end, all that sort of stuff. Is this fair, do you think, Roy? I th look, I think it is fair, H.E., because, I mean, it's fair for... You know, once you... Nobody gets involved with water polo <laughs> unless <laughs> they're... No bloke... I should specify, mm. gets involved in water polo unless they're prepared to be tugged and to tug others. <laughs> uh, it's as simple as that. You know what you're getting into. You know what you're getting into. Mm. And H.G., I've made some of the best friends in the world. Yes. Yes. The best yes. friends. You know, I've, I've got out of the pool sometimes and I've looked down <laughs> and there's just a bit of mince hanging out of my trousers. <laughs> And out of my togs. But you've had the time there. of your life, haven't but you? But I've had a great time. Yeah. And, you know, I've sort of looked across and I've seen a bloke who I've got, you know, and there he is yeah. looking down this big bit of mitts and he looks up and he goes, oh, you got me there. <laughs> <laughs> you know? yeah. It's honestly, it's one of the great... And, you know, what, once you've done that with someone, you've formed a relationship. Yeah, true. True. I've made some of the best friends of my life underwater in water polo. Yeah. You yeah. really get to know people. Yeah. You're always disappointed when the game's over, aren't you? Oh, you are. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you are. Do you oh, think... no, it's, it's great because it's not only dude and bag, it's backdoor as well. Uh, you know, you can really get up there. Now, yeah. Roy, Roy, it, should this be acknowledged more officially in the coverage and should yes. it be brought to the surface? Of course, that's what people want to see. Yeah, thanks. They don't want to yeah, see the right. dull bit up top just yeah, heads the... bobbing about and a bit of that and a bit of that. Yeah, and could it be incorporated in a scoring structure? Yes. Uh, you know, obviously, goals would be a certain things and behinds, yes. just to use, obviously, an AFL uh, cliche, could be part of it. Yes. Or tool tugs or yes. whatever you call it like yes. that. Yes. But would you have, would that become subjective then? There's one, two, three, yes. four, cries, or four, five, six, yes. all that sort of stuff. Or yeah. would it be possible to, say, put your hand in the air when you felt it, mm. be an honest system, of course, and then put the other hand in the air when you had it? Well, you know what I mean? Sure. I'm just, just well, I'm all for encouraging it, though, H. I I mean, if I had my way, if I was head of the Water Polo Federation of the World... Thank goodness you're not. ..I would have each player have a suppository inserted <laughs> of a varying colour, and if you came out with a bloke's suppository, you'd won! <laughs> <laughs> or, how about like in uh, fencing, maybe a bit tricky, they're all linked up, electrically speaking, to a scoreboard. Ah. And, and so it's when there's a tug, yeah. up goes a point. <laughs> yeah, up when, yeah, that's right, you've got an idea. Opposition tug, up yeah. goes a point for them. Yeah. Plus the goals that they've got there. Yes. Now you're talking. Now you're talking. That's a sport. It is indeed. Oh, no, I think water polo is all going here.